Good evening, I'm Gina Kim, and welcome to the fifth annual Los Angeles Organizing Awards brought to you by NAPO LA. This year, the award show is all about returning to old Hollywood glamour. They're getting ready for it right now, so let's go take a look. Five years ago, a small group of professional organizers got together and said, I think we would benefit from joining together to learn, grow, and support each other. NAPO was founded right here. Getting organized really reduces the stress in your life. It sounds like it's structure, but within that structure there is freedom. Everybody can still do with some coaching. There's going to be one habit, at least one habit that you have that doesn't fully serve you. It can really be a groundbreaking experience you know, to change your life in it. And you can really do it with some really simple, small changes. It can actually transform the way they live. It can transform the way they work. It transforms relationships. I feel like I'm helping people to become the person they really are inside and helping them to have the life that they deserve to have. Changing people's life to make it simpler is just amazing. Every morning I wake up and I cannot wait to go do what I do. really contributing to people's lives in a powerful way and tonight is where we get to say good for us we rock it's really frequent that we're behind the scenes as organizers and this is really a chance for us to shine here's what tonight means to me <laughs> this event is a jewel in napo's crown how la could this be i love it you as a group have come together and created a really amazing in industry that is no longer at all in its infancy Every busy woman needs to keep things real simple to stay on top of her game. So on behalf of Real Simple Magazine, thank you for the recognition. Brenninger, but in fact, all of you are very innovative each and every day, the way you do your work. So why don't we just say that tonight, all of us are very innovative in our approach to our work. For people who have tried organizing themselves and have failed, I'm here to say it's not your fault. It's just that the methods you've been using have not been a good fit for your natural way of learning and thinking. There's no one way to organize. If anyone tells you this is the way you must do it, that's the wrong organizer. an honor and I thank you very much and I thank my task force who is incredible in the support they gave me in getting to this point. We like to help people live cleaner, healthier lives. That's really what we're about. And you can't do that when there's tons of stuff in the way. Pare down what you really need versus what you really want. Helping people reframe their attitude to their stuff and really make their lives about the quality of their relationships rather than about the quantity of their stuff. And Peter, you're my hero because I saw you on that Oprah episode where you went and cleaned them people up and the bugs were biting you. <laughs> I'll be honest, y'all are nasty, I got to go. But no, you help them through their stuff, and I'll see you at my house later on. You have the opportunity 
uh, as professional organizers to uh, offer your um, incredible unique talents to uh, those in need and I encourage you if you haven't done so yet to do it because it's incredibly rewarding. From the very beginning when I joined NAPO, I knew that the caliber of people that I was going to have in my life was going to be stellar. Remember that even though we are going through some challenging times, it is also time for renewing yourselves to become even better leaders and for all of us to come out stronger. Do not be afraid to succeed. Congratulations to all the awards winners from tonight's show, and we hope you've enjoyed all the highlights from the 2010 Los Angeles Organizing Awards here from Raleigh Studios in the heart of Hollywood. I'm Gina Kim, and I'll see you again next year.